Hope everyone enjoyed the weekend. A lot of sunshine, warm temperatures. Yesterday, just gorgeous for the first day of summer. Started officially at 1139, and you are continuing that great stretch of weather this morning for a few more hours. Clouds are already starting to increase from the west as there are huge storms out west. Temperature almost 70 degrees as of 7 o'clock. The dew point's in the mid-60s, so it's getting more humid throughout the morning as well. Look at this huge storm system making its way through Minnesota and Iowa. This squall line right here, this bow echo, creating some very strong winds blinding rains and some large hail as well. And it is moving so quickly that it will be in Milwaukee before the noon hour. With that, there are all kinds of watches and warnings out. This is the severe thunderstorm watch box and includes uh, just to the west of uh, uh, Wausau near Colby, out towards Eau Claire, La Crosse, down towards Platteville. Expects watches ex issued here throughout the morning hours. We are under an enhanced risk of severe thunderstorms, uh, including large hail, damaging winds, and even some tornadoes later this afternoon. The morning threat is mainly going to be heavy rain and damaging winds and the potential for some large hail. But as I mentioned throughout the afternoon hours, then into the evening, the threat includes everything, including some spotty tornadoes across the region. This is how it breaks down. By around 11 o'clock, that squall line moves into the area. By around noon, still raining in some parts of the area with large hail and the blinding rain. It'll be out over the lake by around 1, 2 o'clock. And then we'll get a little bit of a break around here in the afternoon hours. The more sunshine we see, the more the atmosphere recharges. This squall line this morning is going to take a lot of energy out of the atmosphere. We have to rebuild it up. And if we see some sunshine, it will do just that. And with the humidity, temperatures in the 80s, and a cold front making its way through the state, there will be another line of showers and thunderstorms developing, which will be severe. And that is where our best shot of seeing some really large hail and some tornadoes is possible. Tomorrow, completely opposite. Northwesterly winds behind the front, lower humidity, temperature near 80, and sunny. It is going to be a fantastic day for tomorrow. Temperatures this morning in the upper 60s to lower 70s already. The humidity on the rise. Those tropical dew points are moving into the area, and that will be fuel for those thunderstorms over the next, uh, I'd say, 12 to 15 hours. Temperatures tomorrow, as I mentioned, will be very comfortable. Northwesterly winds at 10 to 20 will be in the upper 70s to around 80. A perfect summer day with low humidity as well. But then more showers start to move in once again as we get into uh, Wednesday and into Thursday. 79 tomorrow in Tosa and West Dallas and a little bit cooler right at the lakefront. So here's the seven day forecast. 83 today. Look out for that first wave of storms between 10 and noon this morning. Uh, some straight line winds and some large hail and some very heavy rain. Then another round of storms sometime after 5 o'clock this evening with the cold front. Tomorrow, 80 and sunny. 78 on Wednesday. Most of the day looks fine, but a few showers late in the afternoon for the first day of Summerfest. Thursday looks to be rainy most of the day. High of 70. It does clear out for Friday, Saturday, and most of Sunday, but it will be cooler. Highs in the lower 70s.